Hello and welcome back to another episode of War Tales. My name is Aiken and today we're continuing our ever beloved journey into the world of War Tales where I'm trying to survive in this medieval nasty nasty world. We can either go on to a manhunt or uh, do three significant uh, bounties. You can uh, rest uh, well assured that we're instead taking three significant bounties. What are you guys doing here, by the way? Anything to declare? Keep your nose. Okay, these are just guardsmen. I find it fascinating that there is so much detail. Oh, wow. Now we are overloaded. Well, luckily for us, we still got uh, the nice carrying capacity plus 10. <clears throat> Unfortunately, that cloth has completely put us... ...over our maximum load. There is some iron ore up here. Can't let that go to waste, can we? Plus three. Okay, we're getting there. I'm getting my heavy arm, uh, my heavy arm more, one way or the other. And unfortunately, it's time to rest again. Don't like that. But there isn't much we can do, so might as well rest here. What's our chance? 20%. That's okay. Um, before we're going to rest, though, our carrying capacity becomes a pretty sizable problem. Potentially need to get rid of the fugitive's hammer. This here is not weighing anything by weight okay so wood is really getting us down i see how it is we need to create two new, new fish hooks because we need to fish yeah i could buy that as well for extra I see. Well, we need salt if we can uh, get that. Could have bought more in in the town. That actually could have been an option. Cooking two carps. Very good. So, let's do this. And that. And this, and this, and a little bit of that. And just some milk. Why do we get minus six unpaid wages? Yeah, we need money. All right, morale slightly decreased. Camp created resources. Happiness is still fine. We are well rested and we've gotten back all of our points. Your companions have become more experienced. You can now appoint one of them as a captain. Okay, well. Who would be the captain here? I think the guy with a questionable morale, Ender Sanders, could be the captain. What does captain mean? Appoint captain, wage goes up. Hmm. But we get some extra influence, but also the wages are going up. I'm not 100% sure if I like that. You can now craft a strategy table. Well, let's see what that does. 
Iron Ore. High ranking companions assigned generates one extra during each rest. Hmm. Listen, I want to be mindful with our with our iron ore. That's at the moment one of my biggest concerns. Why no one has tended to me yet? Is it not a priority? I'm going to turn to monster if nothing is done. All right, heal him. That unfortunately cost us nothing, apparently. And he is still very much, uh, uh, very much injured. Well, I would love to give you that for an extra reward, but here's the deal. I need resources. And you guys look like just the type of gang that we need to uh, that we need to cut down. We're mercenaries at the end of the day, so can't be picky here. We got a spear, a uh, spear that we can throw. Falling soldier, falling soldier. What are those guys doing? They do have a stunning attack to destabilize enemies. Okay, and she has a really nice battle plate that I would love to get my hands on, but I can already see this potential of going to work. He also does have a battle plate. Holy, can I, for the love of God, please have some decent armor? Uh, the one thing that we could do is... We could actually put ourselves in the mud. And let them come. That's not a bad idea. I'm going to test my recoil shot and a couple of others. Alright. Let's go then. We have plenty of points to spare, so might as well go with it. Good, he's slowed down. We're moving up. Oh, we get two shots. That's even better. Fantastic. If we're engaged, we're getting... Uh, uh, not sure if I want that. Who's next? This guy is next. Okay, cool. Well, which means if we go to here, they would need to move all the way around. That's a good place to get engaged. Uh, they are now engaged. Why didn't it trigger? Hmm. Maybe I would have needed to uh, activate it beforehand. Good. Less damage is always good. And now we need to make sure that we're not spending all of our Valor points.
Uh, galvanized troop. You gain one per ally in the area. Usable once per encounter. Moves here. Gets two temporary. I like the galvanized uh, troops. I <coughs> wasn't even aware that we have that. Moves up. Slashes him nicely. Continues to move up. Burns him. And we are moving slightly away. I think the galvanized troop is from uh, him being a leader. Deflection and and we're actually fighting in melee. He's just holding the line here. Which I think is not bad. He takes minus 70% plus he reposts if needed. Let's just do that. There is uh, the repost. He would have died anyways, but cool. Not sure why we are now burning. Uh, can I heal myself, please? Heals a dying ally, and well, apparently we can't really heal ourselves. Uh, we could do encouragement. That's oh, less damage. We still have that going, but I want Polly also to take less damage, so we're actually encouraging both here nice hit I like it open up ending the turn Soldier is burning as well. Moving up. Hit, he's poisoned and... We're moving over to here. New round is starting. Uh, I think we need... Uh, some extra uh, some extra points available here moves up moves to here teaches the guy a valuable lesson oh yeah I start liking Dilly G's uh, damage that's good Polly is still deflecting and we're ending the turn. We are getting closer. Nice little hit. End of turn. Fortunately, we're burning, which isn't optimal. Yeah, we're letting them flee. Cool. We got a fantastic spear. Strength plus five is good. And repair everyone. Yes. Enders, senders. Gotta level up. And the game kind of taunts me into giving him even more critical chance. 
So yeah, why not? I mean, he's already dealing a lot of damage and that extra um, that extra crit chance base uh, value isn't bad at all. Angler, Bloodthirsty and Equipment, fantastic. So, cut through. It's an extra attack. Costs a lot, uh, but uh, would deal 5 to 6, 7 to 8 actually, uh, if we're doing it from behind. Smokescreen forces an enemy engaged in the area to disengage. They incur an attack of opportunity from their opponent. That is awesome. And Poisoner. Hmm, this one is actually quite good. I like smoke screen. 10 meter area, 9 meter area. The poisoning isn't bad either. Four poisons to all units in the area. It's an AoE attack. And it would... How often did poison trigger? The problem with poison is it always triggers at the end of your turn, not like in XCOM at the beginning of your turn. So... I can see how this is going to deal a lot of damage, specifically through armor, right? But it's, it's also a problem. This here, of course, would be... The mother of all uh, bits of damage, he's just standing behind the enemy, hits, hits, but it costs a lot. However, it would be a lot of burst damage as well, and those extra attacks aren't bad at all. Hmm, difficult choice. Are we going with Poisoner? I don't like the price tag here. Two Valor points is a bit too much for my liking. That here looks not too bad. But I don't know how large the area is. On the other hand, this could be used against a rat. Just like throwing it in there and all of the rats are poisoned. So let's go with an A. We don't have any AoE attacks, so that's even another uh, reason for taking that. Cool. Continue. Well... That was our first task. We can now learn run would still be a good uh, option. Just running away. Uh, we do have a couple of pikes purchase. Herbal tea looks good. We are we're not having a problem uh, with we don't have a problem yet with food. Our problem is really more in the department of not having enough stuff to craft. And not on, on not enough resources either. Uh, this would be increasing carrying capacity. I think that's not bad. Let's just go with it. Basic but all of these here are just making our life easier, and at the moment that's what we need. Stop right there. This salt mine belongs to our ladyship Gontrand. I can't just let you walk in. As you wish. We can't mine the salt because of these two iron veins anyway. I really don't understand why you were so keen to go in. Ooh, nice. Uh, I don't want to steal that though. We're playing a kind of lawful, lawful playthrough. New profession, miner. Uh, who could be that? What does miner do? Constitution plus one, so it's an Emery job. She's already a fantastic cook and a decent blacksmith, so. Mining is just up of uh, her alleyway. I like it. Good. Cool. 
cool nine experience and even better we get a lot of ore 14 Mwah. chef kiss that's what i was looking for okay not very surprising um, oh well that was a missed one Anyway, it's not very surprising you're uh, you're actually getting uh, stuff by doing the respective trade. I like that a lot. Um, we got a lot of iron ore out of uh, that. You cleared out the iron deposits. Well, well, we get our iron, uh, we get our influence back. Fantastic. Cool. Well, I should have done that much earlier. And there is our next uh, troop of enemies. Five enemies, uh, to be precise, all of them level two. Um, now it's too late, but the strength plus five weapon would actually have been quite handy. I should have picked that up beforehand. And I should have also picked up new armor. Leader's aggression, what does that do? Critical hit chance increased by 40%. These guys are six and we are four. So that's one of those typical situations where we need to be really careful and keep this side here at bay. Marcus the we Weasel seems to be the boss and he has a nasty dagger. And a couple of, couple of uh, thugs. This guy, these seem ranged, okay. While well, these guys here, hoodlums, uh, seem melee combatants. But they are not yet in range, which is good. Um, we're seeing this guy first, and then the others are coming. Alright, cool. So... Perfect, he slowed down. Moving a little bit to here. And starting to hit these guys. Also, we're going into the southern corner here. Wow. Okay, they hit hard. All right, Namri, I think we need to do a couple of things here. Number one, um, move up, protect. Move up. Cure the poison and heal him a little bit and teach this guy a lesson. End of turn. Moves to here. Get some temporary uh, points going. Oh, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. Okay, cool. Well, before we're doing anything, this guy goes down.
This guy takes burning damage. And we're doing some poisoning here as well. Just a lot of uh, skills used. Oh, holy moly, that was a great hit. Um, how about we're doing some repost because that will help us just dealing more damage I'm just trying to dish out as much damage at the beginning as humanly possible oh nice they are bleeding and burning and have a lot of other options to die as well. We're just moving down to hmm, to here, blocking the path and end of turn. Polly is taking some more damage. One down, two down, move here, hit all three, and move back. Anders is just not taking no for an answer. Polly takes way too much damage. Moving up. Do we st wait before we are fighting? Do we still have damage taken reduced? Yes, we do still have that. And we have engaged in combat, finally. Moves up. Shoots the poacher back, slows him down. It might have... Uh, might have had a better chance to go for the weasel. There we go. Oh boy. Harsh damage. Don't like it. Kill. Move up. More poison. Because it stacks so nicely. Burning. And we're now engaged in melee, which is exactly what I wanted. End of turn. We're taking, we're taking their surrender in. Need to heal and need to repair. That was a hard battle. Great, great. Oh, finally, thank God we have light armor. And Namri is also, uh, has also leveled up so good. So we can do the defensive stance, which I believe was a great alternative. I, I really like that uh, just holding the line and it fits her character very well. 
so I want to take that one. Willpower would uh, increase the chance to survive. Getting to those 15 points is not a bad idea, so yeah, we're taking that. I think all of the sets do have their place in this game. Willpower 15 uh, would uh, go a long way. Um, in terms of light armor, this one here has movement plus two, critical hit plus one. So I think Enders is going to take it, although it has technically more armor than anything else we're wearing. But I'm very, uh, very much curious if we can get the critical hit chance even higher. This here has Cloud of Poison, applies two poison to any unit that walks through the cloud or ends their turn within it. Wow, such a great, uh, such a great weapon. It's definitely an upgrade to our uh, dagger that we had before. And that in itself was already good. I like the uh, torch also because it's an additional weapon. Just creating that with the burning and having more damage. That's really good. Ender so far uh, is one of my favorite characters. Just He's dealing a lot of damage. Super fast, moves in, has the galvanized uh, troops won. The poison vial turned out to be actually quite good. Yet another extra attack. So that worked well. We do have one-handed uh, one -handed, uh, hammer, which apparently Namri cannot uh, wield as a protector. Maybe we can teach her additional additional um, weapons as well. I don't know. JP Pauli cannot equip uh, the spear, which is uh, too bad. Good, let's sell a couple of uh, items. Are you bandits? We have nothing. We are only refugees fleeing the Ederanian war. Please let us go. Yeah, we're all good. I need the food myself at the moment. Okay, so what can we get here? A little bit of hemp. That's not bad. Can cut wood. Uh, I th who was the woodcutter? That's a bit of an annoyance. We never know who uh, who does what. Strengths plus one. He's a novice, so yeah, he was the woodcutter. We have so much wood now. Well, not if I'm missing these ones. Okay, cool. There's the option to steal, but we don't want to do that. Uh, who was the thief? I think it was Dilly G again. Alchemist, apprentice, thief, right? Dexterity plus one. All right, so I can tell you something. We need to craft a new lock. We need to continuously switch our skills around. This is crazy. All right, lock picks. Let's craft two for good measure. Okay, that's a more difficult lock. the drawing board. Whilst we're at it, let's do that. 
I hope the loot is uh, is worth it. It's a bit like Skyrim all over again. All right, increases the troops' happiness by one. Oh, that was not worth it. Well, semi worth it. I think we've just covered our expenses. Good. What's your problem? How could they? We didn't even put up a fight. And he's mad with grief. Her father chased after them toward the mill. I hope he caught. Okay, I can understand that uh, you are upset they killed your cow. That is unacceptable. As a cow lover myself, can't let that happen. All right, so question, are we going to fight? Or are we going to uh, go back? I mean, we could get new armor. Let's not rush into it. We have enough um, minerals. Or rather. I would like, I would really like to see how we're doing with uh, a bit more sophisticated and, and well balanced group that has their shit together, aka. Uh, that also does have proper armor and so on. So, a um, couple of things here. Miner is good, plus one constitution, but cook isn't bad as well, uh, because that's plus two constitution. There you go. Unfortunately, you can't cook anything. Do we need anything else here? Nah. Nah, nah, nah. We're paying that. Yes, please. Mm, that and that and that and that. Plenty of meat. We're good. And unfortunately, our happiness is going down, but <clears throat> the food uh, and the other companions just so compensated for it. We do have barely enough. Uh, we're barely under that threshold of plus 15 uh, where we uh, happiness. Uh, where we would get the extra experience so i wonder if we could go down that route and get some more some more happiness soon well maybe with the next rest i think for starters if we just pay the soldiers they should actually be happy currently our biggest problem is yet again money Seems to be a recurring issue in this game. All right, first things first. Namri changes from cook to blacksmith, something that she does without a problem. And where is my reinforced plate armor? Yeah, fortune. What's, why is that locked? Print is required. Well, that stinks. The metal plates are heating. Uh, when the metal plates are heating, press the mouse button when it's red to forge the item. When the metal plate sparks to forge an item of superior quality. Hit all of the plates the right time to forge an exceptional quality item. Cool.
First craft bonus, I like it. Regs. Let's forge that. Namri has finally become an apprentice and armor layer available. Okay, so that's a superior quality item. It has apparently a slot. Cool, well, wait, before we're doing anything, what else can we learn? We can go with reinforced bu buckler, buckler. Uh, we could go with a few more weapons. The throwing weapons certainly didn't help us that much. Iron dagger, longbow would be good. Uh, Two-handed axe would be helpful. And falchion here would be helpful as well. So fortunately we're only getting like one weapon per. What else could we do? Cannibalism is off the table. Location markers. Plus one Valor point wouldn't be bad either. I think we're going with run or alternatively we're going with a better two-handed weapon. Yeah, we're getting rid of all of our iron ore, which I hate. Oh, that's not that's not good at all. Can we? Oh yeah, we can finally forge that armor. That'll take all of our uh, well loved and earned uh, iron ore and the cloth. But we would have some really really good armor, and that padded uh, brigade armor, the medium one, isn't bad either. So let's start with that. Oh yeah, we want to do that. Cool, superior quality, even got some extra armor on top of it. And I think we're forging another set of racks because those are better than the items that we currently have. Very good. We could go with another set of racks, but first of all, let's get with the armor. This here is a huge upgrade, like a phenomenal upgrade from 10 armor to 31 for the first time she's looking like a true like melee tank guard plus two armor plus four and we get the protection skill which is like defensive stance but it's free action cool very good i, I like what i'm seeing the only problem that I'm having is what do we put into the, those armor layers? Can I put a tooth in there? No. Well, maybe we'll find that out uh, a little bit later. But that's a great uh, upgrade. Anders already has that light armor, which brings us to the two rags. Better than nothing. Still looks like a complete amateur. But at least we do have more armor. Dilly here takes more armor as well. And the one thing that I've learned so far is... You will uh, you want uh, to have armor to not even go down to the health. Uh, so many of the fights require that. 39% chance that you ignore 50 percent of uh, the incoming attacks that's great i like i love it absolutely fantastic now it's time to sell the rest you can use my anvil 
I can also repair your armor. Don't need that. Don't need that. Good. We're we're actually doing quite well for ourselves now. I still need more iron ore because the next uh, the next uh, forge projects would be uh, the padded brigade armor. That's eight iron ore. We got enough leather and cloth. That's fine. And a padded jacket wouldn't be bad either. So there's kind of a light armor that we could uh, go with. Two-handed uh, two axe would be strength plus six. Potentially even more. But that's better than the axe that we're currently having. So I like how the game is not forcing you, but like encouraging you uh, to, uh, to do all of uh, that in order to get better equipment. Those refugees. I understand there's always one, two, three, four, five. Let's get that up to sixteen is fine. You touch it, you buy it. Well, I don't want to buy anything yet. Come, come, take a look at my wares. Barber kit. Yeah, we don't need that yet. I think that's maybe for a little bit later. For now, I will want to collect my bounties. We're up to 450, that is great. Let's get some more bounties going. I thought you might be interested. I have no further information for you. You all Cool, we got all of uh, the information. Can we Can we recruit someone else? So what are you doing? Spearman. So that would be another melee uh, fighter. I think we could go with one more. That's just a sword man. Wait. Uh, sword man is melee two-handed weapon uh, damage. I was part of another group of and here we do have more archers. Archers seem uh, like a lot of fun, but we already have one archer. Not that that means we don't need additional archers. I think a bit more frontline could be helpful. Hmm, what are we which uh, which of them are we going to hire? We do have enough to sustain our wages for a bit like going up that little bit extra could uh, could be a proof um, proof uh, valuable if we get more uh, Wolf we could get uh, we could get a companion for free Before becoming a refugee, are you Hard working earns 20% um, more experience. I should maybe look at the traits as well. 3% base guard and increase critical. That's actually a really, really good uh, frontliner. Good traits. What are his traits? Um, damage increase 10% if not next to an ally in combat. Huh? Yeah, also not bad. It's a good trade. All right, let's go. So, we got Rothert here. Who could? First of all, increases constitution. I think no one is opposed to that. Constitution is always good. Retain uh, this unit ends their turn next to an enemy and is not engaged in combat. 
uh, you gain uh, something. Um, every time this unit ends their turn next to an ally and is not engaged in combat, you gain something as well. Uh, I think we're going to take this one because uh, this is a melee support. He should be kind of the front line. The spear, uh, spears uh, seem to be semi-ranged, kind of second battle row type of weapons. So let's see if we can work with that. We could definitely uh, grab that um, apprentice um, spear uh, mm, uh, uh, weapon set next because that would allow us to get deckers uh, for ender uh, for ender senders but it would also give us spears which we could use and a longbow so that's actually a really good uh, set overall we can learn that next and here is where we conclude today's episode it has been long enough we did uh, quite a bit and upgraded our uh, team of misfits thanks for watching guys if you want to uh, build your own team of misfits uh, click that like button and maybe you will attract a few mercenaries for hire thanks for watching and see you in today's bye bye